Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Monday, holiday trading week. You got markets near record territory. S&P's positive by two points, trading at 32.27. Dow Jones positive by 108, trading at 28,563. The Dow getting a boost from Boeing. Boeing firing their CEO and that stock trading a bit higher today. NASDAQ up 24 points, trading at 89.48. We got gold catching a bit as well, up almost $8 at 1488.90. Got oil up 11 cents at 60.55. And we have a little bit of lower price and higher yield in the bond market. We have the 10-year, negative 4 ticks at 128.03. The 30-year, negative 12 ticks at 155.28. And the dollar index off 19 ticks right now at 97.672. We'll start things off. Let me see if I can get those charts back up there. Maybe that did it. I, ah, we're having a few problems. We'll jump into it, though. Start things off. We'll jump over to the charts. If you can't see it, record territory. That's the bottom line. Dow Jones, 28,560 currently, reached a high of about 30 points higher at one point. Pretty muted afternoon right now. 1 p.m. Eastern time right now. That's what time the market's going to be closing at tomorrow, Christmas Eve, half day. NASDAQ 100, trading at 87.28 right now, just off the highs as well. S&P is trading at 32.27, almost made it up to 32.34 earlier in the day. There's your crude oil market, $60.56. Gold catching a bit, as I said, as well. Gold actually at session highs, 1489.44 right now. And the euro US dollar between 1 and 92. In terms of what else you have happening in the market, I chuckle because you can't help it. Tesla continues higher, $420. Pretty remarkable. More than a year after Musk had tweeted out, got himself in a little bit of trouble. You have Tesla today trading above that level on the heels of the headline that they secured $1.4 billion in local loans in China to help with the Shanghai factory. And of course, Elon can't help himself. There was the notorious tweet that got himself in a little bit of trouble, saying taking it private seemed to be not the case at the time, and it wasn't the case. But today, whoa, whoa, the stock is so high, $420. And to wrap it up, there's your Tesla chart, $422 it reached today. And we'll wrap it up, how about Apple? Gets a new upgrade, Apple up 1.5% almost at 283.56, all-time high for Apple coming into the holiday season. Stay tuned, folks. Steve Rhodes did his show live at 8 o'clock. We're going to replay that now. Dave White live at 2, Tom O'Brien live at 3. We'll be right back.